Have you been maliciously accused? Wrongly accused? Yeah. What did you do? Did you retaliate? Or are you seeking vengeance? <laughs> no? Good! Actually, I would like to tell you, don't. Yeah. Although, most fight that we have, most quarrels, most conflict that we have, it's not for us to to solve actually. Lalong-lalo na kung retaliation ang iniisip natin. Wala yun sa bukabularyo eh. ba? Diba? Bakit? Because any conflict and battles that we may have, God will fight your battles. God will fight your battles. Okay? Let Him be the one to do your vindication. Gets? Brother Eng here sa ating one word encounter. And yes, we're talking about vindication. Yeah. We will always experience that conflicts and you are being wrongly accused. People are saying something that you, hindi mo nga ma-imagine kung sinasabi mo nga o papaano. <laughs> kung di mo sinabi, you even have asked for forgiveness and wala pa rin nangyari. <laughs> Ganun bale. Diba? Again, I'm telling you, do not retaliate. Okay? Do not seek vengeance. The vengeance is of the Lord. That's what he says, di ba? Vengeance is mine. That's what he says. But uh, this is also what I believe that let the Lord do vindication for you. Mapapatunayan yan at lalabas yan. Basta nakatitiyak ka that your conscience is clear. That your conscience is good. That your conscience is pure. Yeah, alam mo yon. Pag alam mo yon, alam din ni Lord yan. Kung may pagkukulang, ituwid natin, hingi tayo ng tawad. Yun naman yun eh. Kumbaga, we also will not seek retaliation or vengeance, but we have to seek reconciliation. Kailangan as- ayusin eh, di ba? Or better yet, kung hindi naman kayo magpa-eye to eye, basta don't, don't let that anger stay in your heart. Yes? Do not let that to stay in your heart. As you allow that to to be uprooted from your heart and that is now being removed from your life, I want you to receive the peace, okay, the joy, and the love of God in you. Okay? And let God be your joy, be your love, and be the peace that you long for. Yeah. Conflict will always come. Okay? Maybe it's not for you to to uh, settle the conflict. Let, let God do that for you as well. Okay? But this is what I want to assure you, that vindication and your vindication, your vindication, your vindication will always come from the Lord. Because that's what He says, vengeance is mine. Kasi ayaw niya magkaroon ng problema ang ating mga kamay. Gusto niya malinis ang ating mga kamay, malinis ang ating konsensya, malinis ang ating puso. So that we may be able to become the person that He wants us to become. If you feel to get even, don't execute it. Okay? Maybe you, you have to come before the Lord and let it be clear between you and God. And as God would listen to you, and as God knows what you want to happen, I want you to listen to His will, His purpose, and His plan. Okay? Never think of retaliation nor vengeance. Okay? It is the Lord who will do your vindication. And He will give you what you need. Amen? Amen. Come on, let's pray about that. The name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, salamat. Salamat sa buhay. At alam namin na ang buhay ay uh, kasama po yung mga bagay na nagbibigay ng conflict. At ang malungkot nga po, Panginoon, yung, yung conflict or the, the accusation would, would some way, somehow, comes from people that is close to you, people that you love, and people that, hi, ganun bale. Kasi nga, Lord, uh, nagtitiwala ang bawat isa. But teach us how you do it, Lord. Teach us how you, you face your accusers, even without thinking bad for them and thinking that to get even or retaliate but wish them peace and pray for their for their salvation continuously 
I pray that, O oh Lord God, for the people that have that that have hurt me. Oh, if I have hurt them, Lord God, forgive me. And I pray that I will also be forgiven. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for your great love. Thank you. Vindicate me and uh, purify me. Purify my motives. Purify my thoughts. Purify my intention. And let it be the intention of giving you honor and glory and praise in my thoughts, in my words, and in my works. All this I pray with thanksgiving, with Mama Mary praying with us and for us. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Okay? Let the Lord be your vindication. Amen? Or better yet, let the Lord do His vindication for you. And enjoy Him. God bless.